The Jamaica 4-H Clubs is at over 105,000 members and growing strong. This good news also means that more young people will have access to training through the 4-H Clubs. Our mandate is to provide training for youngsters in various areas. As the youth arm of the Ministry of Agriculture, um, that is one of our key focus. With the majority of its membership in schools, the Jamaica 4-H Clubs has been engaging students in both theory and practical skills in many areas. These include the care and management of livestock and small ruminants, agricultural production, agro-processing, home economics, hospitality, clothing and textile, and even aspects of engineering. All this is geared at preparing the youngsters to take on just about any career that may be connected to agriculture. Take for example, Sosna, who is involved in poultry care and management. She believes the training by the 4-H clubs provides a critical platform for achieving her goal. At this point, I'm in grade 10, I do um, agriculture science, so and I, my career choice is uh, an health inspector, so it's really going to help me. So, be what I want to be and be productive and successful in everything that I do. Poultry care, production uh, management teaches you a lot of things. You know how to label the chicken, you know the different diseases that can affect your chicken. In addition, she learns how to build a poultry house, how you feed them and how to document data and manage records. So by the time she's ready to inspect a poultry farm, Sosna will know what to look for. For instance, going out into the working field, you see um, the poultry, you go there and you say that they are not sanit they are not performing good sanitation, so therefore at that point you know the different measures you can take and you know that yes, that is not right and those stuff. So you can tell them and give them that good explanation about it. Other 4-H clubites believe that the level of training helps to bring more clarity to their schoolwork. It helped me a lot in my agriculture work and to improve and know about farm animals. Pertaining to, to the areas of sense, I think it will help them when the teachers touch on that topic. Staying true to its mandate of providing training, the Jamaica 4-H Clubs has also encouraged and facilitated the formation of 4-H community clubs. Young people leaving school are channeled here to further sharpen their skill sets. Meanwhile, those with academic potential are streamlined to tertiary institutions such as the Ebony Park Heart Academy, College of Agriculture, Science and Education or the Nakalva Agriculture School. This is facilitated by way of grants and bursaries. Between 2014 and 2016, 107 agriculture scholarships were issued under the Rio Tinto program. I commend the Board of Trustees of the Rio Tinto Foundation for, in the last three weeks, doubling the resources to provide agricultural scholarship for young people. And what this means, we will be offering a lot more than 107 scholarships. Clubites are urged to get involved in the Youth in Agriculture initiative as this is a prerequisite for scholarships. Information can be obtained at 4-H clubs parish offices. And for those going straight into farming... They will also be provided with input support for agricultural enterprises and cottage industries. The 2014 to 2016 period also saw some 640 youth from rural communities being trained in heavy equipment operations, small equipment repairs, housekeeping and apiculture. They are all certified by the 4-H clubs and Hartrus NTA, with many of them taking up jobs in Canada, other overseas programs. For training opportunities, uh, we set a target of 220. 10, we are currently at 313,000, so we have exceeded our target by far. It is crucial for us to use the tool of youth entrepreneurship to provide opportunity for our young people to escape the chains of poverty and crime. Yes, the Jamaica 4-H Clubs also engages its members in public speaking as part of the Holistic Personal Development Programme. 
there is also drama. Table setting, towel folding, and so much more. Here is what the youngsters have to say about the 4-H clubs. It's a fun club and it teaches a lot of things about life and it also helps you to build self-confidence, bring you out into the world and let you explore the world. It teaches you a lot of stuff about agriculture, home department, your and your health. Yes, and it expounds on everything that you do in this world. It can carry you far in agriculture wise. I like what 4-H is doing in Jamaica. And in the words of 4-H Club's Executive Director Ron Blake, the training is building a cadre of youngsters who are empowered towards good citizenship. Having the appropriate value for vocational skills. And most importantly, they are seeing agriculture as a viable career option.